Hello everybody. As you can see, here I be as the wonderful Red Power Ranger. Alright, so we are joining a brand new server today. Uh, you'll see that there was a previous server. That one left to a new update. Yay, update. So, uh, I have been building in this world quite a long time. You can see their current project down here. Uh, we are actually doing something out of the Terry Goodkind series where we are building the People's Palace. Uh, something I didn't actually see anybody do online yet, so I'm very interested to have it done, post some stuff. Uh, so, right here is my main area of operations with random farms and accoutrements, villagers, all aplenty, and a good old elytra tower. I do have uh, quite a few little automated farms. Elytra too far. Well, bet you I did it again. Ooh. Pro skill. So, if we uh, take a look a little more on the server, we'll find that we have some pretty great things. I do want to get one more aerial of my circle and square work. Uh, took hours. And I mean like hours to get those circles and squares right. Google Terry Goodkind Grace and uh, take a peek at this bad boy. It is absolutely just beautiful. Uh, looking at building the People's Palace there so it's going to be quite fantastic. Now over here we have our town area with a pretty nice setup so we'll start right over here on the edge of town with the elytra tower like a feather so right here we have the uh, potion shop as well as our tipped arrow shop. Uh, this is run by one of the current members of the server. Uh, currently it is not an open server. Uh, we do have a very select and very uh, crucial joining process. Uh, you can feel free to comment, like, subscribe, and if if we vet ya then we might like ya now in here we do have our bottle return because the lady needs backs her potions so uh, over in here we do have uh, you know simple farms simple houses uh, most of these are people's home structures so I shall not be going in there. However, look at this. Oh yeah. Free iron, I tell ya. Free iron. Look at this. Free iron. This is what uh, some would call a manual iron farm. Ouch! Okay. Um, definitely throwing that on. Ow. All right. Ouch. Ow.
boom. See? Free iron. It only cost me armor durability and just a small bit of pride. Now, I took all that time to leap over that fence. There's a gate. There's a gate. Alright, so. Now, right in here, we do have my bookshop. See, I do have those farms we showed earlier that get me all kinds of goodies. I trade with a farmer and other of the like and get my good old villagers. As you can see, we carry all sorts of books around here, all throughout here, and uh, some books to order. Now in here is a beautiful place that I absolutely love. It is an ender chest shop, speaking of which, I do have my ender chest on me. Now we do also have pearls, which are for sale, they are beautiful, uh, no payments as of yet. So, over in here is a more recent addition. It is a wonderful horse stables where you can uh, come over to purchase your horses. As well, uh, they do sell some leather in the shop here. Last I knew, but maybe not anymore. Hmm. Hmm. I'll show you some of that here in a minute. Now, over in here, this right here, this lovely structure, is my stone donation shack. And then we have here the uh, two houses of my wonderful creative children. Uh, they are fantastic. Alrighty, over here. Oh, too far. That was not a pro throw. Over here, we have the light shop. Uh, I like. I, I thought it was cool to call it Light Bright, uh, where we do sell all kinds. Now, we have up here. If I can. Manager Pearl up there. Yeah, I did. Aw. Oh. Yeah, I did. Uh, this is the wonderful wood shop that we have on the server available for us. Speaking of which, what do we got for stock? Ooh, we got a stock. Right. Everybody likes woohoo. Everybody likes wood. Alrighty, so uh, for the next bit, I do believe I'm going to go ahead and hop into the nether real quick uh, to get us to our next spot. Now, as you'll see, we do have uh, ourselves a, let's call it, rough uh, nether hub. But, you know, it's, it's safety in the nether. It really is. It's safety, and you know what? Isn't that what's important? Not dying. Really? Anywho... So, uh, as we come up through over here, uh, this pathway was not originally intended for this purpose, however it became part of this purpose, and we are glad that it did. Uh, this may give you a hint. Oh, I 
Alrighty. So I spent an insane amount of time draining out this ocean monument and just just look at it. It's a beautiful, beautiful little beast. Now there are some imperfections. I have glass I need to trade out, but you know it it does it does the trick. Uh, I have myself a nice little AFK spot down here, and yes, because of my nice beautiful tablet, I get to uh, AFK overnight. Now I have built for myself a pocket edition exclusive feature. Moving hopper in order to be able to get myself up into our AFK platform. Now I like to take my stuff off right up in here because you know how it can be when you're on at night and everything like that. So uh, this uh, it's it's probably not the most efficient farm. However, it was one that I found online to be quite efficient in what it stated. Now, this is a uh, pretty nice little design I've found so far. Um, I do get a, a rather large amount of prismarine and... Uh, sea lanterns and everything. I mean, I was able to open up a light shop. Pretty fantastic. Um, but uh, right here is a nice furnace system because if you're building a project as large as I am out of stone, um, you you need a furnace array. Uh, this good old bad boy is powered via the lava. Uh, everybody loves the lava. It burns real good. Now, I do have this problem because we are here near the Prismarine. And, yeah, I mean, it just, it is a problem. But, we deal. We deal. It's a, it's not so bad when I'm actually AFK, but, man, look at these guys spawn on in here, huh? Just beautiful. Beautiful. Mm. Look at him go. Anywho. Uh, that, well, I guess I can show you real quick. We do have a pretty good storage system for these guys. Again. Again, I dirt. Alright, right in here we have a good storage system. You see, I have gotten a significant amount of fish. And I mean, wow, the fish that come forth from this system. Uh, I do tend to keep everything uh, coming in from the same system. You'll notice up in here that uh, not only do the hoppers from the furnace, but also the hoppers from here end up funneling in and that makes everything run beautifully. As we arrive here too near the surface we get to see uh, that they spawn in uh, pretty, pretty normally. You can see they're funneling down in there. They enjoy it uh, pretty good. Now, of course, I have been playing on this one for a while, as one can imagine if I'm this far in. Uh, I do, of course, I fly. I have my elytra. I've been to the end. Kill the dragon. Uh, do find myself to be a pretty pro player. Um, that being said, I'm a Minecraft player. 
I don't always do good. Uh, uh, just earlier today, just died. Just died. It's never fun. Never fun when you die in Minecraft. Um, hoping out a buddy though. Didn't manage it. But, um, we did go ahead and recover our stuff and, uh, get, get back a trekking. So, I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, have the, the tour of the server kinda conclude at this point, cause I'm gonna go ahead and start in on the Grace Project, which is what this is really all about, you know, trying to, trying to get that good, beautiful rendition of the People's Palace I'm, I'm seeing in my noggin here. So, uh, I do have these elytra towers placed in a relatively good position, so as to be able to fly from one to another with a, a reasonable ease. However, if I could get rockets, oh, Please, it would be a godsend. I would love to be able to to have rockets and and fly permanently here. So, uh, but until then, you know, you love what you actually have. Now you'll notice the the walling over here. Uh, this is the kind of structure we're gonna strike up towards this level, and uh, we're gonna fill in uh, pretty much all of this as we go along but see down on this scale uh, you don't you don't see the grace the same way and when the walls are up and we're starting the the detailing and turning this into a castle complete with minecraft farms and everything it'll be it'll be beautiful um, do you like to toot my own horn a little bit? I am just a, a s little bit of a, a redstone wizard. I tend to dabble here and there. But uh, as you can see, I got myself some resources ready for us to uh, begin our building today. Um, there really isn't a whole lot that I am probably going to get done. Um, but I can at least bring forth a little bit of what I'm looking for here. And, uh, you guys can get a little hyped for the next one. So, uh, we do have the ability to add to the server. It's not, you know, impossible. But we've had griefing in the past, and man, nobody likes to be griefed, especially not when you work so hard and so long. Bugs are painful enough. Let's, uh, it's not grief, man. Love your Minecraft community. Enjoy. Everybody loves to play. So, um, let's go ahead and get one more, one more quick aerial view. I do, I do just, I love the flying. It's, oh, fantastico. So, ladder climbing, not the funnest. Now, there is a couple of tricks I have to shorten the journey. Uh, but I really, I wish I had better. So, one more quick aerial view of this here, because, man, she is just gorgeous. Let me get her all into render distance. There it is. All of it's in render distance now, so. Boom. It's just beautiful so as you can see over here uh, we are looking at 
having villager farms in this area at least a few of them I'd like to see I'm probably gonna switch those for grass blocks because I think it'll look better and then obviously that'll be all tilled land in there and uh, we can see over here that uh, there is a significant amount of space uh, not only down in here you can see giant wall um, but also in over here there's a large amount of space um, and I think that these can be used to good effect um, We'll see after I build upwards all this what I do in a downward perspective, but I definitely know that this this is a thing. This is this is huge. But when you get when you get all of it done, you know it'll it'll be quite beautiful. So um if you guys are stoked want to see a little bit more then definitely uh, like comment subscribe anything that you may feel um, we do have a long long way to go on this project and I'm just getting started